so we're used to rounding to the nearest tenth, but we can adjust our method to round to the nearest hundredth as well. We follow the same steps. We find the place value we're rounding to, so the hundredths in this case. Remember, the hundredths digit is always the second digit after the decimal point. Then, we look at the next digit along, so here, the thousandths place. Because it's five or more, we know that we are rounding up, so our hundredths digit increases by one, and then we can ignore place values to the right. So 1.616 rounded to the nearest hundredth is 1.62. So what is 7.573 rounded to the nearest hundredth? We find our place, look next door, and because it's a 3, we know that we're rounding down so our hundredths digit will stay the same. So 7.573 rounds down to 7.57. Now, what about 23.422? It rounds down to 23.42. And finally, See if you can round 40.079 to the nearest hundredth. There's a 9 in the thousandths place, so we round up to 40.08. Because remember, when you round up, you add 1 to the digit you're rounding, and digits to the left of the place value you're rounding to always stay the same. 